We are done with 2017 we World's Toughest Mutter. Yep. Mm -hmm. Our last dance here yep. in Las Vegas. Yep. And uh, we, you just announced we're going to Atlanta next That's year. right, yes. Um, you know, uh, all good things must come to an end. And this has been an amazing venue. But you know, we always try and innovate, keep things fresh at Tough Mudder. We felt it was time to move on. And the Atlanta venue is an awesome venue. So I think the community is going to love it there as well. So I'm wondering, because there have been so many rumors. Yes. I mean, those. Last year, people were saying we're going to Scotland. Yeah, I know yeah. when we were both in the UK, yeah. I was like, "Will, are we going to come? Because yeah. we're right near your home." Yeah, yeah, we were. Yeah. Um, but how did you guys come up with Atlanta versus yeah. maybe moving it to another country? Yeah, so there's a couple of things there. I mean, we certainly looked to taking it internationally, um, and we have a lot of mothers in that community in the Atlanta mm -hmm. area. I know, obviously, it gets a lot of people from the East Coast, but more than anything, it's an amazing venue. Yeah. You know, it's the end of season. You know, we have to go somewhere where it's reasonably warm for obvious reasons. You know, like Tough Mudder's <laughs> tough, but we don't want it to just be about the cold, <laughs> like maybe it was back in Jersey in the early days. So uh, it's an amazing venue, and um, we think we can build an epic course there. And we think you know we're getting people from all around the world coming to these events now. So Atlanta's a great transportation hub. Um, but you know, we're doing more internationally. We're doing more toughest internationally. Mm -hmm. One day I suspect we'll end up doing a 24-hour event in Europe as well. But you know, Atlanta will attract a lot of internationals, so we're excited to be there. Well, I'm excited that you're going to Atlanta versus yeah. going back to like New Jersey again yeah. because mm -hmm. there was nothing like trying to break through your ice at 3 a.m. Yeah, in the yeah, yeah, morning. Yeah. It was a little chilly in my <laughs> It was yes. very yeah. chilly and yeah. you traumatized me so much in 2011 that I didn't even do 2012, mm -hmm. the only year I've missed okay. because I was because it was so cold. So everybody, I'm sure, and we say this now and it'll yeah. probably end up snowing in Atlanta next Yeah, yeah, who knows, who knows. But it you haven't will. announced the date yet, so is that something that will be coming out soon? Yeah, very soon. Soon, very soon so we'll be around this time next year so uh, you know it's always going to be the end of season for us you know we're building up the sport of the event and you know, we've always been about community and teamwork Definitely. but we're trying to develop the sport side of it so we have more toughest we're taking the toughest to Australia this year to Germany we're adding another one in the UK and more media around that so yeah always going to be the end of season finale for us at least for the toughest community and of course next year we have Tough Mudder X as well Definitely. whole new sport Definitely, and I'm really excited to see that you're expanding Tough Mudder X into yep. more than just one event. Yep, so yep. that'll be. Will that? Will all of the different events be part of the CBS package, or what is CBS? Are you guys so we're, having we're, that we're doing a lot. Year? We're doing a lot with CBS. Yes, we'll be partnering mm -hmm. with them next year. Definitely, everything on the toughest side will be with them. Probably TMX as well. We're figuring some of that out <laughs> at the moment. Then we have the partnership with Tougher, which is with Facebook, and you know, we'll be doing a lot of stuff with them. More live streaming with them as well, which we're super excited by. And then we've got a lot of international partners now, so we're working with Sky Sports, we're doing another reality TV show with them, and we're working with ESPN to take uh, our content global. And will you be doing the same stuff, with, is that Amazon, is that going to continue as well? That's the plan, forward? that's the plan. The next trip is to Seattle, so I'm going from here up there to figure out what we're going to do with them next year. We've done some really incredible content with them, you know, the story of Superman and his journey to World's Toughest Mudder, you know, the first adaptive athlete to take part in our event. Incredible story. I know the Amazon team are very supportive of that. We want to do more with them as well. You know, Tough Mudder is all about storytelling. It's all about the community. It's all about the everyday heroes. Yes, you get the winners who hit 100 miles, 110 miles, but it's about the everyone and their goals. Be it 25 miles, 50 miles, and changing people's lives. Excellent. And is there any words? If you have words to the community, um, any words from Will Dean, the founder yeah. of Tough Mudder, about? What are your top three reasons to come to a Tough Mudder event in 2018? So, what are the top three reasons to come and do a Tough Mudder event? So, so the first thing is next year, everything we're about is tougher together. We're about community, we're about bringing people together. For some people, that's a 5K, for some people, that's world's toughest mudder. But doing something that gets you outside of your comfort zone, that challenges you, that's how you build confidence, that's how you make yourself mentally stronger. The second reason to come and do a Tough Mudder is it's fun. It is fun. People always think, Okay, I'm out in the desert for 24 hours. It's tough, it's challenging. And then the third thing is, it's a community. Now, unfortunately, we live in this age where people don't spend enough time with each other. We spend all our time interacting via social media. Tough Mud is real. This is Margaret Schlachter with Mud Run Guide, and we are wrapping up our coverage of the 2017 World's Toughest Mudder here in Lake Las Vegas. As we spoke with Will Dean a little bit earlier tonight, or this morning, he 
year for 2018 World's Toughest Mudder and he said we'll have more details coming up in the next couple of weeks so we'll have that on Mud Run Guy. But just want to say a huge thank you to all of you who watched all of our coverage throughout the weekend as we've got lots going on here still. All of you that watched our coverage over the weekend shared our post, shared the streams, were out there on course busting your gut. Myself, A. Green, the coverage, Phoebe Brimer over on Instagram, Brad Kerr and Bob Mulholland shooting photographs for us. So make sure that you give a huge thanks to all of our team. And that's just about it, wrapping up our 2017 World's Toughest Mudder coverage. And we'll, we'll keep you informed when we learn more about 2018. Thanks, everybody.